On the 14th of November 2023, a new Skyblock update dropped, with the potential to completely revamp farming by adding a new way to actively gain crops. The Pest Update Luckily for most farmers, traditional farming has remained the best way to gain crop collection. But for a short period of time, pests became the best way to gain collection for a certain crop and even made getting to rank 1 in said crop possible which was seen as impossible before. Today, we will take a look at how pests broke the farming meta. Before we continue, a quick explanation on what pests are. Pests are small creatures that can spawn on plots when farming in the garden. They can decrease your farming fortune if too many are present on your garden at once, but vacuuming them up rewards you with loot, some of which is unique to specific type of pests. The number of pests that spawn is determined by your bonus pest chance stat, and there is a small cooldown between spawns where no pests can spawn. However, when pests were first added to the alpha server, people quickly realized that the pest cooldown could be reset by swapping lobbies. But, since the chance to spawn a pest was really low back then, it wasn't worth it to abuse the fact. That was until the pest mechanics were changed on the 12th of March 2024 with a big buff to the pest spawn chance, which meant that now the limiting factor to spawning pests was no longer the spawn chance, but the cooldown. Thus, by using the lobby swapping bug, it was possible to almost instantly spawn a pest and combining this with farming cane and using mushroom armor for max bonus pest chances allowed players to spawn over 250 pests an hour. While most players abused this bug to make the most money possible by focusing on beetles, there was a smaller group of players who had another goal. Collections. You see, there is a pest that gives way more collection than the others. The fly. By farming flies using the bug, players were able to get around 4 million wheat collection per hour, which is almost triple the amount of wheat you would get by farming normally. This also meant that getting to rank 1 wheat, which is considered by most farmers as something impossible, would only take about 2000 hours if the bug remained. Luckily for Bankier, it didn't, and after 2 weeks, the bug got patched. Nowadays, pests are only good during Finnegan's perk. Outside of that, they are not very significant, except for the fly. Doing flies is essential if you want to climb the wheat collection leaderboard, but most of the top wheat farmers hate that flies are so important for collection and would love to see flies getting balanced. However, there are two ways flies could get balanced. Either all other pests could get buffed to the level of flies, leading to pest farming becoming a better farming method than traditional farming, or nerfing the flies to match the other pests. The opinion of top farmers is very clear. Pests shouldn't be buffed, as it would both destroy farming's laid-back nature and force players to farm cane in order to gain max rates for other crops which in turn would make farming them normally inane. 